What's up, everybody? How you doing? It's me again, Fitz, the acupuncturist out of Miami, Florida. So, this is the first time I'm gonna I'm gonna try Prime, all right? And I'm also gonna do a review about it. I'm gonna do a reaction video about it, I should say. Okay? So, I never had this before. So this is gonna be my first time tasting Prime in front of y'all. And I'm also gonna let you know how it tastes. And is Prime good for you? Should you buy it or should you not? Is it healthy or not? All right? So, um, I just wanna say, first of all, Prime has been everywhere in the news, for good and for bad. All right, um, you know, it's on my Logan Paul, KSI, and stuff like that, and it's also a sponsor of the UFC, so it's really popular, all right? But recently, it's been getting some bad reps, some bad um, mojo, you, you should say. Now, this, this prime thing, when it comes to sports drinks and stuff like that, I'm very hesitant, because there's a craze right now with, you know, Gatorade, electrolyte water, and this and that, blah, blah, and prime is, is is basically advertised as if you're a hardworking athlete, Prime's gonna you know you know help you and this and that. You know I don't know all that because you know I've been hearing some mixed results about Prime. But I'm gonna go ahead and taste it for y'all right now and let you know how it tastes. So I'm gonna taste Prime so you don't have to if it's you know bad. Okay, here it goes. I guess this is the lemon lime flavor of lime. And again, this is my very first time tasting Prime ever. Okay. It's not, the taste isn't that bad to be honest. I'm not gonna lie to you, the taste isn't that bad. Um, now, as far as it's doing what everything it says, it, you know, in the advertisement, as far as making you replenish your, your fluids and this and that, whatever, I'm not so sure of that. Because on the label, um, it says it has about 10, 10 milligrams of you know, sodium, I believe. And, um, but then it has like 700 milligrams, 700 milligrams of potassium. When it comes to electrolytes, you don't want to have extreme ends, <laughs> okay? You want to have a nice balance. Our body does a wonderful job of balancing our, our electrolytes anyway, right? So this is not meant to drink, you know, for lunch, for dinner, just to drink every day, in my opinion. You know, stuff like this is meant, is, is good for athletic stuff, you know? And I don't think this is the best one when it comes to replenishing your fluids and stuff like that. I think, you know, getting away is still, you know, pretty good. If you um, just finish doing, you know, some strenuous exercise and stuff, okay? So, Gatorade, Electrolyte water and prime and whatever is not designed to 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 drink it during lunch or dinner, <laughs> right? Stuff like that is designed for for athletic performances, right? So, like I said, my first time tasting prime, um, it's not that bad of a taste. I'm not gonna lie, and I'm very picky with my taste buds. I'm I'm very picky with food and drinks, but it not it does, it does not taste that bad to be honest, right? Um, is it good for you? I don't know if it's good for you. Um, you know, it's one of those things where you could drink it just to drink it, but I don't recommend drinking it just to drink it, okay? Any any sports drink, unless you like water, get away, it, it, it's designed to drink after um, exercise. So the question is, is Prime good for you? Do I recommend Prime? Well, let me tell you right now, as an acupuncturist, who basically wants to get people as healthy as possible, I don't recommend drinking Prime. Right? Um, because it's not the best drink out there when it comes to healthy drinks, right? Let's be real. So, that's my opinion. Let me know below if you agree or not, but as, a, as an acupuncturist, I don't recommend Prime to anybody. Alright? So let me know what you think below.